I think medium-sized businesses do face a number of challenges. First and foremost, many of them are stuck in a place where the ability to actually grow is constrained by a number of factors. Part of it, frankly, is their own ambition. There are a number of medium-sized businesses that don't really have the ambition to grow any further. It could be for all sorts of reasons. They are satisfied with their lot, they're making plenty of money, they're family-owned, they're stable. That's okay. But it does mean that one of the challenges is, if they want to grow, the ambition level has got to be there. The second is really around capabilities. There are a lot of capabilities required to grow a medium-sized business. And the capabilities made a small business a medium-sized business aren't the same as those required to make a medium-sized business a large business. An example, the ability to raise finance. I'm sure we can talk a lot about the lack of financing availability, but part of the story is also the ability to put together a compelling business case and use that business case to attract investors who are going to put in fairly large sums of money in order to progress the business from a medium size to a large size. Quite often those capabilities aren't there. In fact, one of the findings from our report was if we could improve the capability of medium-sized businesses to the levels seen in other countries, that in and of itself would, could raise their growth rate from, let's say, 5% on average today to somewhere around 6.8%. So we see lack of ambition or the need for ambition, the need for management capabilities as two fundamental challenges that confront the medium-sized businesses of the UK.